it um, kind of no, baffles I, I, me I, I that you know there, there hasn't been more of a uh, uh, a reaction from not just the Nigerian government but the international community and I don't just mean the citizens who are speaking out which is great but I mean like the it, like countries I'm talking about the UN I, I may I may not be aware of that but the, it doesn't seem like it, like other countries or international bodies have stepped in this is this is a massive these are mass kidnappings of young girls if, if this was happening in Sweden if this was happening in London like there would there would be a, an outcry if these if these if these, if these, if these young girls were were white <laughs> or were from first Wembley. first um, quote unquote first world nations it, there would be so, um, there, th these countries would do something so um, me I'm, I'm, I'm a believer that only the only the people are going to change things I mean I, 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 I have an apparel line that speaks to that called liberated people and and, and, it, and we speak constantly about how the power always lies with the people so we can't really depend on on nations or the heads of heads of nations to, to you know to do this. You know, we, we put them in power and we have to make sure they, they do things that serve the people. And finding these girls is, is a priority. I, I honestly I'm kinda of, I can go on and on about this. I'm just really amazed that this is this is actually happening in two thousand fourteen and then the reaction to it and or lack thereof is, is, is what we're experiencing. All I know is that these girls are still missing. All I know is that there are eight more girls I believe taken today or yesterday. You know that so that and that they need to be brought back. I don't care who does it. I don't. I don't care. I almost don't care how it's done. I don't. But it, it need, they need to be brought back, and people need to be held accountable.